Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about the new sponsored brand's AI generated imagery feature. This is a very exciting new feature that Amazon just released and it has the potential to revolutionize the way that we create sponsored brand ads. With the new AI generated imagery feature, you can create unique and engaging product images for your sponsored brand's ads without having to hire a professional designer or photographer. All you need to do is pick a product from your ad, submit a custom image description, and choose an optional image theme. Amazon AI will then generate a custom image for you that is tailored to your specific needs. This feature is still under development, but it has the potential to be a game changer for Amazon sellers. By making it easier to create high quality product images, Amazon is helping sellers to create more effective sponsored brand ads. In the rest of the video, I'm going to show you how to use the new AI generated imagery feature and give you some tips for creating effective product images. Subscribe to my channel for more Amazon selling tips and advice and like this video if you find it helpful. Right. Okay, so if you go and click on create campaign and you choose the sponsored brand ads here and then obviously you're going to give the campaign name, the budget, you're going to choose whether um, you're driving page visits or grow the brand impression rate or automated bidding, you choose all these settings that you already probably know and then the targeting of course and then you scroll down to this section where you actually see the custom images here option, you're going to click on it. And then when you're going to click on add another image, you have the option to choose an AI generated image. We're going to click on it and let's read what they are giving us and what is the options. So, so custom generated AI images, save time and let your product shine with one of a kind images. To generate more specific results, add an image description and theme. If you really want to get like the best option, make sure that you give specific instructions, description to get the best out of AI. Like we know it's all about the prompts. It's all about what you feed the AI uh, tool. To use an image or share feedback, select the image. Before you use an image, make sure it meets our ad policies and all relevant laws. By using an image, you accept these terms. So we're going to choose a product here that I already have. And let's uh, input something uh, to this tool, okay? So let's write kids, or you know what, adult women organizing her cabinet, her kitchen cabinet. Tim, let's use Tim. We already have a uh, kitchen, not farmhouse. And let's click on generate. You can also feed the system with the custom image that you upload, which will create, I guess, similar versions of it. But let's wait to see what we are getting here. <clears throat> all right so we got our product fit in uh i'm going to blur it but it says my product here inside like you know uh a kitchen uh, countertop i don't think that it's the best uh product but let's try to tweak the prompt that we're giving adult woman uh using our product to organize our kitchen cabinets. This is a little more specific and let's see what we're getting here. Um, I, I, I must tell that it's a little slower than other AI tools that I used and not that great as far as the first results that we got, but let's see what we're getting when we optimizing our prompt and the image description that we provided. I hope that we will get something that is better. Again, it's kind of very slow so and annoying, but let's see what, what we are getting. So again, it didn't really add adult women. Uh, that's kind of annoying. 
So, you know, let us know. Do, try try it on your own. Let me let us see. Because like, it's very slow, I'm not going to run more and more uh, prompts here and generate more AI uh, images. But try to use the tool. Let us know. What do you think? Do you even have that feature? It's, only, uh, it's still on beta. So probably not all users um, will have that access to that tool. But share with me. Do you have access to NDS? Did you try it? What are your thoughts about the tool? And again, uh, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one, sharing with you the latest updates and tricks and everything about Amazon FBA. Thank you.